pushed off the boat, still wet and hot. Don't turn around now. Boy, the cops just waited on this. What do you say? A half a buck, four bits, half a half a banana. What do you say, huh? Say, these pages are all black. Are you kidding? Of course the pages is blank. Invisible ink. You gotta hold it in front of a flame. Too hot to carry. Hey, Lefty! Lefty! Boy, I've been hunting all over for you. I'm really knocked out. Here. The landlady said to give you this wire. Oh, boy. Happy days is here again. Good news, huh? Oh, you ain't kidding. Hey, hey, wait a minute, Lefty. Haven't you forgotten something? How about crossing my palm with a little more? Uh, well, uh, I tell you, I want to do you the biggest favor of your life. Yeah? You are now the owner of the biggest publishing house in New York. But not... Thanks. What, 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 madam? Pay our rent or out you go. But, my dear madam, you are placing the country in jeopardy. We are at war, madam. Head Tungsten is the backbone of a nation. Do your part. I have here a gilt edge hair of the Epidabba Montana Tungsten Tunnels. Take it. Oh, in six months, you too can become a war profiteer. People hate you as they hate me. You said it. But what will you care? You will be rolling in millions. Ten dollar bills will lose from your... Paper. I don't want millions. I want six dollars and forty cents now. What do you want? A telegram for you, Mr. Phony Deacon Davis. Thank you. Madam, you fell into something. You are now the sole owner of the Abadabba Tungsten Tunnels. And may the Priority Board have mercy on your soul. Hey, buddy. I got a tip for you. It's hot as a firecracker. The two for me. Rose quartz. The second. Second? This is the third. Rose quartz ran last. Uh, smart, huh? Hey, lady. Don't be a mooch or don't be chump. Huh? Get smart. I got a tip for you. Fifteen to one. It comes straight from the jockey. The horse loves me. I give him sugar. Sugar? Well, you ought to be ashamed of yourself, haven't you heard? Huh? Willie, how says? Oh, Curly, take this food hunger. I got a telegram for you. Willie. What do you got for me in the next race? Carly, you was talking to the wrong character. I ain't interested in horses no more. <laughs> Be that tough. Gee, boss, I'm hungry. I can't take it. Yeah, that, that goes for me, too. Shut up. I've been feeding you for years, ain't I? Yeah, but not for the last three days. I said shut up. You got a nickel mouse? You mean a slug. All right, a slug. Give it to me. Give with the body, English. If I hit the jackpot, we eat. If not, get your gats ready. We're going to do a little job in the cigar store. Gats away. We're going to Central City. Yeah, 
Thanks, Doc. Our three-fingered Louie. Oh, he's swell. Good. Looks like a juvenile, Doc. I live right. I'm telling you, there's no fun being honest. Help yourself to a drink. I gave up the most lucrative publishing house on 44th Street. Hello, Lefty. Hello, Doc. Hello, Hello Willie. Hello, Doc. You should have seen my customers. There was the 400, some of the 200. That's nothing. They were begging me to be their pal. There was the governor, a couple of isolations, an occasional stool pigeon, and even a lady. Gentlemen, with a mere 